Welcome to Aptitude Concept video, Algebra. Algebra is a fundamental topic of quantitative aptitude. We use this concept of algebra in almost all the quantitative aptitude topics. Say for example, if you want to calculate the simple interest, we use the formula P and R by 100. Here, P is a variable, N is another variable, R is another variable. You have to do some calculation and get the value of P or n or r. So you have to find the numeric value by assigning a temporary alphabet. This is called LG. So if you want to solve the problem based on algebra, you should remember some basic concept. So first one is polynomial. Polynomial is nothing but an expression. So for example, p x square plus 4 y square plus 3 x plus 2 y plus 48. So in this term we have 5 different expressions that is 3 x square, 4 y square, 3 x, 2 y and 48. So it is 5 different expressions. So this expression is represented as a polynomial. So in polynomial we can have some other subdivision like if you have only one term. So if you have only one term, that is 3x square, then it is monomial. If you have two terms, 3x square plus 4y square, it is binomial. If you have three terms, 3x square plus 4y square plus 3x, then this is trinomial. So if you have more than three terms, then that is called polynomial. So polynomial is nothing but the expression. So next, what is degree? Degree is the highest power in the given polynomial. So in this case, the highest power is x square. So 2 is the degree of this polynomial. So here, so in case if you have equation like this, 4x plus 7y plus 8 equal to 0. So in this case, the highest power of the variable is 1. So degree is 1. So highest power is called degree. Next, what is coefficient? Coefficient means the numeric value which is present near the variable. So the coefficient of x square is 3. Coefficient of y square is 4. Coefficient of x is 3. That is numeric value near to the given variable. That is called coefficient. These are the some basic terms we use in algebra. So remember these terms. We will discuss the concept um, problem based on algebra concept in the next video. Thank you.